You got a minute? Sure. What's going on? Valentine's Day. Aw, oh, baby brother needs some love advice. So this is my second year with Lori, and I really have to impress you this time. Oh, that's right, because last uh, Valentine's Day, you took her to that special restaurant. What's it called again? The Golden Arches? Thanks, because you know, she doesn't remind me of that every other day. Sorry, okay, you're saying? So, I'm writing her a song, and I have a bunch of ideas, but I don't know which one to go with. Could you listen to some and tell me what you think? Sure, go for it. <laughs> Girl, you give me blue skies when my world is gray. You are mine, only mine, now until the end of time. I love you, love you, love you. And that's it? That's the whole chorus? So far, why? I heard an A section and something of a B section, and so far, both are all about you. Huh? But I'm saying you are mine, and you give me a brain. What else you have got? <clears throat> I saw you, our eyes met, like Romeo and Juliet. We are destined for forever. Come on, babe, it's now or never. I love you, love you, love you. Now or never? Kind of pushy, isn't it? It's not pushy, it's intense. Uh huh. And what's with Romeo and Juliet? Most romantic couple of all time. Didn't you pass ninth grade? Sure. You see a girl at a party, you're proposing now or later, and you're both dead in three days. Definitely romantic. Go with that. Here's another one. <clears throat> right now you are here with me. Who knows what tomorrow may be. But girl, we've got right now. Right now, whether near or far, as we're driving in my car. Hey girl, we've got right now. You run like a third grader. Lay off, will you? It's a rough draft. So, it got a nice groove and all that, but I think you got a bigger issue. If you're gonna play this for Lori, she's gonna think, Okay, we got right now, but we know what tomorrow may be. What if we mess up? What if I hear this girl tomorrow, then what? That wasn't what I meant. I know, but she wants to know it, that you're in it for the long call. Right. And she's gonna think, why am I driving a car with a third grader? I'm just gonna block you out now. Glad I could help. Okay, okay. Here's another one I started. This one's a little edgy. <clears throat> Girl, did you ever have a clue that I would be your hero true? In a sea of empty deeds, all those guys who tried their part, they could never win your heart. Then your prince came and knocked them off their steed. I love you, love you. Whoa, damn boy. What, you couldn't handle the edge? The aggression, the arrogance, take your pick. I just want her to feel safe with me, not them. Whatever, okay, last one here, going for raw honesty. Raw honesty, I can't wait. No matter what, you're always late. You never think you're the right way. I love you when you're not so cool and when you fall asleep and drool. I know that you don't like to clean. Your locker looks like a crime scene, but I love you, love you, love you. Are you kidding? What? You're even considering playing that for her? Well, yeah. Hey, you didn't let me get to the good part. I rhymed oversight with overbite. You're killing me. You're gonna catalog the woman's fault and call it a love song. It's a song about how I'm accepting her faults. Isn't that what a girl wants in a serious relationship? Here's a hint. If you mention them, it doesn't count. Well, that's what I've got. I guess I'm not much of a songwriter. Well, it's not that the songs themselves are bad. Well, they are, but that's besides the point. They say a lot of things, but they don't say love. Well, your idea of a love song is impossible. You want it to be all these things, like all night, and selfless, and long-term, and waiting forever, and not aggressive, and not mentioning any of her faults. Oh, come on, did you just pull that first Corinthians thing on me? Me? Hey, you did to yourself, man. Love is patient, love is kind. Best love song of all time. Guess I've got some rewriting to do. Or instead, how about a dozen roses?